Welcome back. A new little project. Here's the plan. First of all, I'm going to turn this piece of metal rod down to 16 millimeters diameter between centers. And why 16 millimeters? Well, because it's going to suit this socket that fits in the milling machine. And uh, this rod will then be welded to this plate. I drill a hole in this plate and turn down the diameter a bit so to suit this hole in the plate and then I will weld the two parts together and then I can mount this in the milling machine and then I can use my articulator holder turn it upside down and the magnet goes on the plate and then I can use this articulator holder to tram the milling machine that's the plan I will now turn this diameter down to 10 millimeters to shoot the hole in the steel plate and the length of this 10 millimeters diameter will be 8 millimeters. Something like this and I have a recess in, on the bottom side and I will be welding this side and then I will mount this between centers again and turn this through and then cut this off and uh, then it's ready to use. And uh, here you can see it is set up in a milling machine for uh, tramming the milling table. And here you can see the indicator is showing zero. And then I'm going to move, uh, rotate it 180 degrees, and then we see what we got on the other side. And here is, you can see the other side, and then it's about thirty hundreds of a millimeter and it's higher this side. I have now adjusted the milling head and we're back here on the left side 
and I have zero the indicator so I will swing it over 180 degrees and we check the other side here I have swing the uh, milling head no not the milling head I have rotated it 180 degrees and uh, the indicator points at zero so uh, the milling table is now trimmed and uh, it's looking pretty good and it's nice to use this uh, articulator holder for the first time and it seems to function as it was meant, meant to, to function. So thank you for uh, watching this short video. Hope to see you soon. Bye bye.